Welcome back to another episode on Beho Reviews in Gaming and Entertainment. In this episode, we take a look and review Hot Shot Racing. Released in 2020 by Curve Digital and developed by Sumo Digital and Lucky Mountain Games, comes a fast-paced arcade racer reminiscent to the arcade racers of the 90s. Looking at how the game looks and feels, you instantly feel like you're playing one of Sega's old virtual racing game with a twist of OutRun 2006 Coast to Coast. The visuals take a back seat in this one, making each model with a low poly count just like virtual racing. With drift mechanics, the game feels like it takes notes from OutRun 2006 and it blends in fabulously. The game is filled with bright colors and runs silky smooth in all iterations on all consoles. No matter which one you play will run great. I'm running mine on the Xbox One X and at 4K. There are no hiccups at all and I have seen so far and even online. Performance alone doesn't make a good racer, especially with little to no options for those 1990s arcade racers. In this budget title going for $20, there is enough options keeping you busy with its addictive gameplay. Single player, you are able to race with 16 different tracks in 4 different Grand Prix, where you race against the AI or friends. I was unable to test the split screen, but from all reports, it runs smooth as well. You are able to choose from a different variety of racers who have different cars to choose from. Each car will differ in acceleration to drift power, which makes each car feel that much different from one another. Drifts will give you more power boosts, while cars with less drift power will have a higher acceleration to compensate. Online play is especially fun and chaotic, leaving the user to choose from Cops and Robbers, Arcade, and Drive or Explode. Cops and Robbers one driver is designated as a cop as a chase to knock out the other car's health bar to ultimately catch them. Arcade is basically just a racing game with real people and real opponents in a single race where you can change the difficulty, number of races, and the course. It is much more fun when racing real players as everyone is more aggressive than just the AI controlled players. For Drive and Explode, the idea is to wreck each other who is the last to live wins. Each car will have their own health bars and once it depletes, you explode. The faster you are at avoiding the sides and most other cars will keep your health intact. You earn currency by playing races and win whenever you can in the races. You can use that currency to buy different costumes and upgrades to your favorite car. Overall, Hotshot Racing gets an 8.5 out of 10 for exhilarating racing of the past given a rise from the dead attitude, but also goes all out for this budget title. Many options to play with great addictive gameplay leave this racer a welcome gem that really comes out of nowhere. That's it for me on this episode on Beho Reviews. Please like and subscribe if you like my videos. Beho out and great. Take us out of here.